Hello, welcome back to B2 Codes. Now, as I have said earlier, I'll show you the process of installing Node.js on Linux. So, I'm currently on Linux and so I'm going to show you how you, how you can install Node.js on your Linux machine. I don't know if this comment works for Windows or Mac or something like that. You can give it a try if you want. Now, this video is particularly for the Linux users. So, today I'm going to show you how you can install node.js on your linux machine so for that the first thing that you need to go is open your terminal and type a particular command which is sudo app install node.js all right so let's start this and write so sudo app install node.js press enter and then give the password and you can see it is installing the Node.js on your computer or on your laptop. Now, in most of the Linux machines, Node.js is already installed. Also, if you install Node.js like this, uh, the version that is going to get installed may not be up to date. So you have to upgrade the upgrade the version of the Node.js that you have installed. So to save the version at first, you have to write node space hyphen then v. So this will particularly check the version that is currently on your laptop. Now you can see I have the version which is 8.10.0. Now this is an outdated version. There are, there, you know, I'm going to show you. Go to the browser and you can type nodejs.org and you can see that this is the version which is LTS version, I mean long-term support. This is one of the most stable version right now. And this is 16.x which is the current version and has the latest features but it's a bit unstable now, whatever we are going to install like we are going to upgrade like you can see my version is 8.x now i'm going to upgrade my node.js from 8.x to 14.x so how to do that so there are some there are a few comments that you have to go with and that will upgrade your current node.js to the particular newest version so now coming to the upgrade part how to upgrade uh, the current node version to the latest node version on your linux machine so that's very easy now here the role of nvm comes to play like that's the reason in my first like in my last video i told about how to install nvm on your machine now to check if there is nvm installed on your machine you can type nvm space hyphen hyphen and type version and this will show the version that is currently installed on your Linux machine. And if you have not installed NVM, I have made a complete video on how to install NVM. I will give the link, you can go and check it out. Now, as I have NVM installed, it will be easier for me to upgrade my Node.js from my current version to the latest version out there. So, first thing that I have to write is NVM LS. The next, I can see here a lot of things. The next you have to write NVM ls remote so this will basically give out all the lists of the node uh, js that is out there like the version of all the node js updates out there so this is the latest lts version and the and the latest current version that is going on is version 16.10.0 so these are all the versions of node js if you want to install any one of them you can go and install now how to install it so for that we have a very simple command that is nvm install space and then you can uh, write the version that uh, like the, any version that you want to install like if you want to install this latest lts fermium version then you have to write 14.17.6 and if you want to install the current latest feature node.js then you have to write 16.10.0 now as i'm going to install the LTS version I have to write 14.17.6 now if I press enter everything that's needed to install the node.js current version is um, will be installed on your Linux machine now I have already installed version 14.7.6 and that's the region is written here is already installed if the current version that you want to install is not installed on your uh, machine then after writing this command it will directly get installed here is no problem at all so that's how you can upgrade your node.js to the current version it's really very easy these are some of the comments you don't have to worry about all these comments i'll give everything in the description you can go and check it out 
So that's all for today. I hope you guys like this video and I'll see you in my next video.